Hello guys, welcome back to some more Call of Duty Black Ops 3. Yeah, I forgot the name me. for a second. Don't worry, I will for now. And hopefully I don't crash this time. Or hopefully Steam doesn't decide to update uh, when I'm actually recording this time. Yeah, Steam updated something, that's why uh, it was like that. So I lost connections to the online services of Steam and that is where the saves are stored. Oh, it just appeared out of nowhere. And I have activated my special ability thingy now. So that's cool, you know, so uh, yeah. You're standing in a clearing. What? Okay, that sounded that was pretty random, dude. The trees around you so tall they touch the sky. He sounds so like he's not even seeing so much pain. You can feel the melt on your skin. Okay, very aggressive, huh? You are not cold. Nah. I mean, yeah, I'm cold. Gotta say everything that's opposite, you know, to convince myself. Can you hear it? <laughs> No. You have only to listen. Do you hear it loud? Do you hear it slowing? I think my guy is having a mental breakdown. You are slowing it. You are in control. Calm. That's the opposite of calm. Aha! This gets sucked into whatever this is. Wait. Wait, am I going? Oh, I see. Just swim. Just swim, it's alright. Thank goodness. All right, let's go. I don't care what I have to say, Doctor. I know what you did to them, and that's not okay. The harder we looked for the frozen forest, the further away it became. In our search for answers, we found ugly truths. The project that led to my birth also caused the deaths of hundreds of thousands of souls. I wanted to find a place of safety for all of us. I wanted an end to death, but I couldn't escape it. Death was carved into the hearts of every single soul I encountered. I don't know if I made Dave fire the shot. Or if he did it of his own free will. Do you know? I don't know. It's all wrong. I didn't kill those people. D and I were supposed to make everything better. Instead, Corvus has got all these pieces, but it doesn't know what it is. There's so much noise in my head, I can't even think. Who am I? Who are you? I don't even know your name! Who are you? Why do you fight? Oh crap, I gotta shoot him! This is your last chance! Show me what you're made of! Do it! Do it! Just do it! Fight it! Fight it! First it, I don't know what I just did, but, but I think I did it. Twenty percent? What else am I supposed to do?
So I'm supposed to like approach it more? I'm supposed to go in here, I guess. Listen only to the sound of my voice. No. Let your mind relax. Let your thoughts drift. Let the bad memories fade. Let peace be upon you. You are in control. I don't know what's just happened. Alright. Imagine yourself. What's your name, soldier? In a frozen forest. I said, what's your name? Taylor. That's pretty confusing. So, wait. So, what happened was... I still don't get it. So, so Taylor is now me? <laughs> and I'm no longer me? Because I was wiped with the thingy and th therefore Taylor's mind was saved into mine? I don't know. But anyway, it's pretty interesting. It's pretty interesting. Now... I know for a fact this is a co-op campaign, so I'm gonna give it credit for that. I always love co-op campaigns. I'm a sucker for those. So that's gonna give it one extra point, just saying. Campaign, uh, story-wise, it's it's not the best, but it's also not bad. It's like, it's like meh, it's... Like, it's, it's worth me and, and yeah, because they tried new things, they tried to have the cyber core system implemented that in a way, and like, tried to um, implement leveling into the campaign, which I also kind of liked, but... Like, you have to replay it to get all the camos and all the level ups and everything, so... They're kind of making you do that. It's all right. It is. It's like all right with that stuff, and, and it's no big deal if you're not a completionist like me. <laughs> so, I guess it's good for the people who actually like uh, like it that way. Plus, co-op. I mean, if you have friends to play with, leveling system, weapons to use, all that stuff is good. Now, one thing I didn't really like was. Uh, how exactly the main character was portrayed. I like that he had a personality, but his personality sucked to be honest. He was the most boring character of all of them. He just seemed very, both very cold and very just, I don't care about anything kind of person, except he's like, I care about things. I know, he, he just had a mix of personalities, I feel. I don't know whether that's on purpose, or if it's just like, meh. Uh, they didn't think about it too much. But I would love the character to have had some more personality into uh, him, or her, or whatever you decide to play as. Just something so, you know, you actually actually identify with the character, because I couldn't identify with any of the choices except saving people. I, and it's something everyone can identify with. So it was, it was, it was definitely a right that, uh, that I didn't like when it came, came, came to character identification, or identifying with the character. The last level design with the crows, I don't know who came up with that, but I really hated it, and I kind of liked that I hated it, but then again, I kind of still hated it. <laughs> so, yeah. Another thing that, um... That I like is the gunplay. The gunplay is uh, smooth, not too demanding. Didn't really like the robots though. Like they, they just man, they're not the biggest fan. But I can't really play in the game for that. It's the future, and the robots are part of that. Slapstick dick. <laughs> what? Okay. 
but it was definitely definitely a good game like I, I was captured in the campaign I completed everything in one day <laughs> so yeah I enjoyed it most of the time and then the other time I just didn't understand why they made half the decisions they made the writing could definitely have used some uh, could definitely have been better the, the writing definitely yeah Uh, it would, be an, would have been good to see more of an effect on the main character and be talking about the, the experiences instead. Like, you saw how he was freezing and he was like in the main character in, in the frozen forest or whatever, and uh, he never said anything to anyone about him seeing things. Like, it just seems like the main character is just all by himself. Like, he he wants to shut everyone out and everything, and I just don't like his character at all. So, it's just. Uh, it's, it's not that good when it comes to the main character and the, the main character is the most important part of um, of this so we're kind of glad that, they, that he somehow became Taylor so that, that's good ah, but the whole enemy that is the enemy within I also hate that idea but it's also alright it's already finished with the credits well <laughs> anyway my 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 score is, I would say a six point five out of ten, either a seven out of ten or six point five out of ten. So, yeah, uh, that, that's what I'm gonna give it. For all those reasons and for being creative as well, I'm actually gonna put it up to seven because they were creative again, uh, like in in most of the cases. Still not a biggest fan of it, but they were creative, so good on them. Good on them. Plus the simulation with World War Two, that they're getting extra credits for that. So, so it's a seven. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough. Uh, if you did. Don't forget to uh, to let me know in the comments or by subscribing or liking or something <laughs> like that. Um, yeah, let me know what, if you want any other games. Like I'm up for playing other games, so don't hesitate to let me know in the comment section. Otherwise, I have nothing more to say other than hope you enjoyed this playthrough. Hope to see you in the next one, and as always, stay awesome.